New pictures caught by the James Webb Space Telescope have shocked scientists. As opposed to expanding our comprehension of the universe, these images uncovered an upsetting reality. Our current understanding is lacking to make sense of the idea of the universe in its beginning phases, where the theory of the Big Bang arrives at its limits. This drives us to think about new theories about its starting point. The inquiry emerges as to how the universe was formed exhaustively and why this new revelation challenges even the most experienced astronomers to figure out more about the Big Bang and the intricate details of the discovery. Let's review the concept of the Big Bang itself. In spite of popular belief, the Big Bang was not an explosion in pre-existing space. Rather, it was space itself that began roughly 13.8 billion years ago, alongside matter and time. From a singularity in physics and cosmology, a singularity describes spots where gravity is so intense that the curvature of spacetime becomes infinite. Today, after billions of years since the start of the universe, we observe that our vast home is part of a principal cycle. For specialists, this addresses a natural component of the universe since its very existence. It's apparently an unending expansion. However, it's pivotal to comprehend that the universe isn't venturing into prior space. Rather, space itself is continually expanding in size. According to current theories, the primary stars began to shine somewhere in the range of 200 and 300 million years after the Big Bang, marking the finish of the so-called Dark Age. This was when the first luminous celestial objects bunched together to form mature galaxies. However, how rapidly these galaxies developed remains an inexplicable mystery. A significant piece of information arose through the first pictures caught by the James Webb Space Telescope. In July 2022, specialists reported that the telescope had recognized various galaxies, some of which had previously existed around 300 million years after the formation of the universe. However, compared with the cosmic structures that formed a long time later, these early galaxies remained significantly smaller and less massive. This fits impeccably with the scientific model accepted by scientists. The density of matter in the youthful universe was simply not sufficient to give rise to galaxies the size of those observed today. What began as the discovery of six luminous redshifted spots from the James Webb Telescope ended up triggering one of the most significant cosmic crises of recent times. Although these newfound galaxies are comparable in age to previously recorded galaxies, they are nearly as large as our own Milky Way galaxy. This has created an intriguing mystery in galactic exploration. After examining a series of pictures caught by the near-infrared camera, specialists recognized the previously mentioned light sources using redshift. Researchers determined that the light from these objects took more than one billion years to reach our eyes on Earth. Therefore, we are dealing with structures that had already existed between 570 million years after the so-called Big Bang. By analyzing the characteristics of these structures, it was concluded that the Webb telescope had captured six very early galaxies in the images. Shockingly, these galaxies were so massive that they challenged conventional assumptions for cosmology. Rather than finding the usual dwarf galaxies, structures were identified that were nearly as massive as our own Milky Way galaxy, despite having formed early in the universe's history. If we continue to examine the data gathered by the James Webb telescope, this gravitationally bound gathering of stars was already more than 10 billion times the mass of the Sun at that time, with one possibly exceeding the 10 billion solar mass mark. However, regardless of whether this chance is considered, the mystery isn't entirely resolved. Even in this situation, there would be significantly more heavenly mass in the early universe than previously expected, presenting a riddle. The identified objects contradict nearly all traditional cosmological hypotheses. Even if only one of these galaxies turns out to be real, it would challenge our prior assumptions. Moreover, the density of matter in the early universe would have had to be multiple times greater than previously anticipated to explain this phenomenon. Another equally strange explanation depends on the fact that these galaxies formed in a manner that is still entirely obscure to us. These revelations and the discussions surrounding the Big Bang are driving more scientists to move away from this hypothesis. Many astrophysicists with alternative views feel their perspectives are not being heard in scientific journals. Even those who express doubts about existing theories are often labeled as unwarranted whims. However, it is clear that even scientists who still defend the Big Bang hypothesis are continually confronted with questions without definitive answers. These questions include specific issues such as why and how 
13.8 billion years ago, something literally emerged from nothing. Might something truly ever start from nothing? Or was there some triggering event? Or was it all a coincidence? Steven Weinberg pointed out that the concept of time as we know it began only with the Big Bang. Consequently, this process could not have been triggered by something external. A similar controversial inquiry relates to the consistency of radiation and density throughout the universe. Regardless of which direction or at what distance we look on a larger cosmic scale, we find similar densities and distributions of galaxies, nebulae, and radiation everywhere. Moderate researchers explain this phenomenon through the theory of cosmic expansion. However, different specialists take this assumption further with a theory of tumultuous expansion. According to this idea, inflation has only ceased in certain regions, like bubbles, and continues infinitely elsewhere. This implies that numerous universes could be forming in these bubbles, each with its own individual physical laws. Within this model, a major question arises, what if the universe doesn't represent the complete whole? And, more intriguingly, what if another universe existed before our own? In that case, the Big Bang would become a part of a larger cycle. According to this viewpoint, our universe is part of a bigger, multifaceted structure. Within this model, the idea of an eternal pattern of collapse and resurrection of the universe is advanced. However, this is not the only perspective presented in the realm of cosmology. Apart from the theory of the universe's origin in 1955, for instance, an article appeared in NASA's Space Times arguing that there may have never been a Big Bang since the universe has existed for an infinite time. In this view, the expansion of the universe would be non-existent, and the continuous arrangement of matter could give the impression of a consistent expansion. However, another captivating hypothesis arises from the universe of quantum physics and string theory. Some experiments have proposed that our universe and everything in it could be simply a flat 3D image projected onto a surface. Consequently, there is a possibility that our world is a consequence of a higher simulation. While this might sound like the plot of a whimsical sci-fi film, it may indeed be related to the Kardashev scale, which measures the degree of advancement of a civilization according to its ability to harness energy. If there were a Type 3 civilization capable of fully harnessing the power of an entire universe, it might have created an ideal simulation. Nevertheless, understanding reality in such a scenario is an extremely complicated matter. Investigating the depths of cosmology and the origins of our universe leads us into a realm of profound mystery and ongoing scientific inquiry. The new pictures caught by the James Webb Space Telescope have reignited conversations about the very fabric of our reality, testing established theories and prompting researchers to re-examine fundamental aspects of cosmological understanding. At the core of this inquiry lies the theory of how things came to be, a foundation of modern cosmology. According to this hypothesis, around 13.8 billion years ago, the universe rose up out of an incredibly dense and hot state, expanding rapidly and giving rise to space-time and matter as we know it today. This astronomical event is not just an explosion within pre-existing space. Rather, it encompasses the very beginning of space itself. The idea of a singularity, where gravitational forces are so intense that space-time curvature becomes infinite, supports our understanding of this primordial epoch. Yet the discovery of early galaxies by the James Webb Telescope challenges our assumptions about how rapidly structure formed in the universe's earliest stages. These galaxies, identified within a few hundred million years of the Big Bang, appear shockingly developed and massive, contrary to expectations based on current cosmological models. One of the major questions raised by these discoveries is the concept of cosmic expansion. According to the prevailing theory, expansion occurred within parts of a second after the Big Bang, causing the universe to grow dramatically. This rapid expansion would explain the uniformity of the cosmic microwave background radiation observed across the universe today. However, the recent discoveries suggest complexities in the early universe's development that may require adjustments to inflationary models. The formation of galaxies like those seen by the James Webb Telescope compels cosmologists to reconsider the conditions and cycles that govern the universe's initial evolution. These galaxies, now significant in size and mass just after the Big Bang, imply a density of matter that exceeds previous estimates. The mystery deepens when considering how such massive structures could form and evolve in a relatively limited span of cosmic time. 
Additionally, the discovery of these early galaxies raises intriguing questions about the nature of dark matter and dark energy, two elusive components that constitute most of the universe's mass and energy content. While dark matter is believed to provide the gravitational framework necessary for galaxy formation, the distribution and properties of dark matter in the early universe remain uncertain. In line with these astrophysical mysteries, theoretical physicists are exploring alternative cosmological models that challenge the conventional Big Bang worldview. Some theories suggest that our universe is merely one among many in a vast multiverse, each with its own unique physical laws and constants. These ideas, emerging from advancements in string theory and quantum cosmology, propose a more intricate and interconnected universe than previously envisioned. One concept gaining traction is eternal inflation, wherein universes continuously arise from a larger inflating space. This hypothesis posits that our universe could be just one bubble among countless others, each with its own distinct properties. The challenge lies in finding observational evidence to support such theoretical ideas as they push the limits of empirical verification. Another provocative speculation is that our universe exists within a simulated reality akin to a computer-generated recreation. This idea draws parallels to advancements in artificial intelligence and computational science, where simulations can reproduce complex systems with astonishing fidelity. If true, our perception of reality as a distinct physical universe could be fundamentally altered, raising significant philosophical and scientific inquiries about the nature of existence. Furthermore, advances in observational astronomy continue to uncover the universe's immensity and complexity. Telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope, with its exceptional sensitivity and resolution, promise to unveil even more mysteries of the universe. Future observations may shed light on the earliest moments of the universe, providing insights into its ultimate fate and the underlying principles that govern its evolution. Beyond observational astronomy, Particle physicists are investigating the fundamental particles and forces that shape the universe. The quest to unify gravity with the other three fundamental forces, electromagnetism, strong nuclear force, and weak nuclear force, remains a central objective of theoretical physics. Concepts such as quantum gravity and string theory offer possible frameworks for understanding these fundamental interactions at both the smallest and largest scales of the universe. In the realm of quantum mechanics, the concept of time itself remains a subject of intense debate. The idea of time as a linear progression from past to future is challenged by quantum theories that suggest time may be emergent or even elusive at the fundamental level. Understanding the nature of time within the context of cosmological models could revolutionize our comprehension of the universe's beginnings and evolution. Additionally, the search for extraterrestrial life continues to captivate public imagination and drive scientific inquiry. The discovery of exoplanets, planets orbiting stars beyond our solar system, has expanded our understanding of planetary diversity and the potential for habitable conditions elsewhere in the universe. Future missions, such as the James Webb Space Telescope's investigation of exoplanet atmospheres, may provide evidence of biosignatures indicative of life beyond Earth. In addition to these scientific endeavors, Social and philosophical reflections on the universe enhance our understanding of our place in it. Questions about the significance of existence, the possibility of intelligent life elsewhere, and humanity's future in space exploration inspire thought and debate across disciplines. As we stand on the brink of a new era in astronomy and cosmology, fueled by technological advancements and theoretical breakthroughs, we are reminded of the profound interconnectedness of everything from the smallest subatomic particles to the vast cosmic structures spanning billions of light years. The universe reveals its secrets to those willing to explore and question. In conclusion, the investigation of the universe and the origins of existence is a journey that transcends disciplinary boundaries and challenges our most fundamental assumptions about reality. The revelations made by instruments like the James Webb Space Telescope offer tantalizing glimpses into the early universe and provoke new inquiries regarding its evolution and development. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of dark matter, dark energy, and cosmic expansion, we move closer to a broader understanding of the universe and our place within it. Through collaboration among cosmologists, physicists, philosophers, and technologists, 
we embark on a monumental journey to decode the cosmos, a mission that promises to redefine our understanding of existence itself. Whether exploring the depths of black holes, charting the trajectories of distant galaxies, or contemplating the nature of reality, each discovery brings us closer to unraveling the intricate tapestry of the universe. As we venture deeper into the cosmos, guided by curiosity and driven by a desire to comprehend the universe's vastness and complexity, we are reminded of Carl Sagan's words, Somewhere, something incredible is waiting to be known. This sentiment embodies the essence of scientific exploration, a continuous journey of discovery, wonder, and enlightenment that continues to inspire generations of scientists and thinkers alike. In the words of Albert Einstein, the most beautiful thing we can experience is the mysterious. It is the source of all true art and science. As we confront the mysteries of the universe, we are invited to embrace uncertainty, challenge our assumptions, and seek new perspectives that broaden our understanding of the universe and ourselves. Thus, the exploration of the universe is not merely a scientific endeavor but a profound human quest for knowledge and meaning, a journey that transcends the confines of space and time, inviting us to ponder our place in the grand tapestry of existence.